Training a language model like ChatGPT involves several steps. Collecting and pre-processing a large dataset of text. This dataset is used to train the model, and it should be representative of the type of text that the model will be used to generate or understand. The text must be cleaned and pre-processed to remove any irrelevant information, and it should be split into smaller chunks, called sentences. Defining the model's architecture. This includes things like the number of layers in the neural network, the size of the hidden state, and the number of attention heads. Initializing the model's parameters. The model's parameters are typically initialized with random values. Training the model. This is done by iteratively feeding chunks of the dataset into the model, and using an optimization algorithm to adjust the parameters so that the model's output is as close as possible to the correct output. Fine-tuning the model. After the model is trained, it is typically fine-tuned on a smaller dataset that is more specific to the task it will be used for. Testing the model. The model is evaluated on a test set to measure its performance and make sure it generalizes well to unseen data. What is parameters in the language of ChatGPT? In the context of language models like ChatGPT, parameters refer to the values that are used to define the model's structure and behavior. These values are typically represented as a set of numbers and are learned by the model during training. This learning process involves adjusting the parameters so that the model is able to make accurate predictions about new data. The parameters in ChatGPT include things like the weights of the model's neural network, the size of the network, and the values used to configure the training process. In general, the more parameters a model has, the more complex and expressive it can be, but also the more data it requires to train effectively and the more computational resources it requires to run. Examples of the parameters in ChatGPT. Here are some examples of parameters that are used in the ChatGPT model. The number of layers in the model's neural network, this parameter controls the depth of the network and can have a big impact on the model's ability to understand and generate text. The size of the model's hidden state. This parameter determines the number of neurons that are used in each layer of the network. It can affect how much information the model can store and how well it can process that information. The number of attention heads. This parameter controls how many different ways the model can attend to different parts of the input text when generating output. The number of tokens in the model's vocabulary. This parameter defines the total number of unique words and symbols that the model can understand and use when generating text. Dropout rate. This parameter controls the amount of dropout used in the model during training, which helps to prevent overfitting. Learning rate. This parameter controls the step size of the optimization algorithm used to update the model's parameters during training. These are just a few examples of the many parameters that are used in the ChatGPT model, and the specific values used for each parameter can have a big impact on the model's performance.